go for day nine and the countdown. It's good face days, Buddha's blend. So the entire sample had eight grams, which is like two grams over. Very uh, peachy and floral. And I'm waiting for my 185 water to boil. All right, so the directions actually say 175 for one to two minutes. So that's what we're gonna do. So the leaves are floating in there. Looks like there's also flower bits. So and I'm going to go for the one minute on the one to two minutes because we had more leaf than was strictly necessary. So it's got a yellowy orange green color going on here. Pretty standard for a white tea. It's translucent and pale. Alright. Smell is like hint floral. But like a vegetalness. Taste is very floral with a vegetal finish. I think I might have actually, like, I followed the directions 175 instead of 185, and I might actually decrease the temperature on this a little bit because it is tasting a bit grassy instead of like fresh spring greens. I'm gonna go get honey. All right, I've added a spoonful of honey. Much better. I also think turning down the temperature of the water would have worked well, but now it's much more like fruity, floral, fresh greens. And sweeter. So that's actually pretty pleasant. Hopefully the re-steep is also good. Um, I would potentially buy that one again. I'm more of a black tea person, but that was tasty.